Hi everyone, I'm Omar and in this video we'll explore another new exciting feature in Excel, the AI fill function. This tool leverages AI to help you fill in missing data in a spreadsheet. So let's get started. So here I'm in Excel and I have this list of some countries with the capitals of the first two countries and their biggest cities. But as you can see, the other countries do not have their data filled. And I want to use an AI function to fill in these data automatically based on the data from the previous two rows of Turkey and Egypt. So in order to do that, I will use a function called AI.fill, but this function doesn't come automatically with Excel. It comes with an add-in called ChatGPT for Excel. You can see it has many functions. I did a video about AI.ask, you can watch it in my channel. And today we will explain the AI.fill function. But if you don't have this ChatGPT for Excel yet, you can add in from the add-ins here, and you can simply search for its name, ChatGPT for Excel. Then you add it to your Excel add-ins, and you can start using it. But since it is already in my Excel, I can go into the table here, and I will use this function automatically. I will press here on the first cell that I want it to be filled out, and I will put equals AI dot fill and first I will choose the already completed data or what's called example so this is the completed data next I will choose the partial data that I have which it needs to be completed in this case it's the first column here in this table and I will close the brackets, press enter. It's now generating the answer. And as you can see, I got the data filled out for the other countries, for Brazil, USA, UAE, India, and so on. So the important thing here is to have a sample data which you will give to AI, and the AI will detect this data sample and it will respond based on that. So an important trick is to put the sample data always next to each other as I did in the video where I put the sample data in the beginning on the top of each table so that it's easier to select it all together and then I put the partial data also below each other in this column here so that I can select it in the second part of the function and as you can see this helped me to use the function efficiently and quickly and I think it's a very useful function which will help you to fill in sometimes tens or hundreds of missing data in your Excel. Great! Now you know another new exciting feature in Excel, the AI fill. If you missed watching the other AI feature, which is AI Ask, you can watch it from here. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and to like this video. See you!